that everyone thought was on the verge of an explosion, but what the James Webb Space Telescope has captured now surpasses all expectations. The scientific community and skywatchers alike are left asking, are we witnessing a never-before-seen celestial phenomenon, or is Betelgeuse, this mysterious red giant, hiding something even more incredible beneath its flickering facade? Betelgeuse, one of the most enigmatic and gigantic stars in the firmament, has always fascinated scientists, astronomers, and the curious minds of the general public. Its intense brightness and sheer size, approximately 1,400 times larger than our own sun, have inspired astronomers throughout the ages to observe it not only with admiration but also with caution, intrigue, and expectation. The massive red star is classified as a supergiant, residing prominently in the constellation Orion. But in recent years, something strange began to unfold in its cosmic narrative. Betelgeuse started to behave unusually, losing brightness in a way that had never been documented before. Many began to suspect it was close to going supernova. A few years ago, a surprising observation sent ripples through the astronomical community. Betelgeuse began to fade, and not just a subtle dimming, but a dramatic, rapid decrease in brightness. For a star that normally shines so brightly, this phenomenon triggered a flood of speculation, generating a wide array of theories and assumptions. Was this colossal star dying? Were we about to witness one of the rarest and most spectacular cosmic events in our lifetime? A supernova explosion visible from Earth? Excitement mixed with anxiety gripped both professional scientists and amateur stargazers. Expectations were at an all-time high. The variation in the brightness of Betelgeuse was so drastic, so pronounced, that many truly believed the end was near. Such an event, a supernova explosion visible from Earth, would be unprecedented in our modern history. The last naked eye supernova in our galaxy was observed more than 400 years ago. So, naturally, the anticipation was intense. The year that followed was full of uncertainty and relentless observation. As more data were collected, theories about an impending explosion gained traction. But despite the fluctuating brightness and the mountain of speculation, the long-awaited explosion never arrived. Then came the James Webb Space Telescope, a marvel of human engineering and scientific ambition. Designed to see deeper and farther into the universe than any telescope before it, the launch of Webb represented a monumental leap in our ability to observe the cosmos. With its golden mirror spanning more than six meters across, the James Webb Telescope was built to peer into the most distant corners of the universe, capturing light from ancient stars and galaxies billions of years old. Yet it was also designed to help unravel mysteries much closer to home, within our own galactic neighborhood. Naturally, Betelgeuse became one of the prime targets for Webb's powerful gaze. Could this state-of-the-art instrument provide answers about what was really going on within the heart of Betelgeuse? Was it possible that we were looking at a phenomenon so rare, so intense, that it defied the known laws of astrophysics? The wait for a concrete answer was nerve-wracking and almost unbearable for scientists across the globe. And finally, the image arrived. The first real, high-resolution photograph of Betelgeuse taken by the James Webb Space Telescope stunned the world. This image wasn't just visually breathtaking, it also offered a completely new perspective on this legendary red supergiant. However, what scientists saw in the image was not what they had expected. Using its infrared capabilities, the James Webb Telescope revealed Betelgeuse in greater detail than ever before. Not only did the star appear massive and turbulent, but it also displayed a strange and complex pattern across its surface, something that had only been guessed at before. What the scientists observed was astonishing. Far from being a dying, fading star, Betelgeuse was revealed to have hot spots and large bright regions across its surface, indicating that it was not in its death throes, but rather undergoing dynamic and violent activity. These previously hidden details showed that Betelgeuse is surrounded by a vast cloud of gas and dust, material it had ejected itself over time. Violent explosions on its surface seemed to create this ever-shifting and turbulent appearance, adding new depth to our understanding of its behavior. This intense and extreme activity could very well be responsible for the fluctuations in the star's brightness that had puzzled astronomers. The James Webb image revealed that the surface of Betelgeuse is something akin to a cosmic battlefield. Huge regions of the star would brighten and dim within just weeks, an extremely short time frame for a star of its immense size. These phenomena, known as stellar mass ejections, involve the star ejecting material outward in various directions, creating spectacular and evolving clouds of gas that surround it. Such unpredictable behavior sparked numerous theories among scientists. Some believe this behavior is a sign that Betelgeuse is indeed entering the final stages of its life, potentially setting the stage for a future supernova. 
Others suggest the star may be undergoing a form of restabilization, perhaps bouncing between stages in its long stellar evolution. But regardless of which theory proves accurate, one thing is crystal clear. Betelgeuse is not behaving like any other star of its type that we've ever seen. What we are witnessing with Betelgeuse challenges the foundational knowledge we hold about stellar life cycles. While astronomers have studied and modeled the life and death of giant stars for decades, the detailed data provided by James Webb suggests that the processes involved may be far more complex than we once believed. The image doesn't just reveal a dying star, it forces us to confront the reality that even the most well understood cosmic phenomena still hold mysteries. More than just a moment of awe, the James Webb image of Betelgeuse prompts reflection about the vastness of time and space. It reminds us of our own fragile place in the universe. If Betelgeuse were to explode into a supernova, the event would be visible from Earth for weeks, illuminating the night sky with a brilliance equal to that of a second sun. And yet, despite its awe-inspiring light, it would pose no threat to our planet due to its safe distance, over 600 light-years away. While we would remain physically unharmed, the intellectual and scientific implications would be immense. Such a monumental explosion would release an unimaginable amount of energy into the cosmos, providing astronomers with a unique, once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to study a supernova in real time. It would allow researchers to observe the mechanics of a star's final moments, uncovering how these cataclysmic events distribute vital elements like iron, oxygen, carbon, and other heavy materials that are essential to the formation of planets, and, ultimately, life itself. The James Webb image not only sheds light on the dramatic life cycle of stars but also holds key implications for the future of space science and exploration. Observing phenomena of this magnitude enables scientists to understand how planetary systems form and how essential life-supporting elements spread across the universe. In fact, much of the matter in our own solar system, including the oxygen we breathe and the carbon in our bodies, originated from supernova explosions of